you want a balloon, I can fly one. So that was in July, and in September we bought a truck and drove to Kalamazoo, Michigan, and got a basket. And in October we got the envelope, and I started taking lessons, and that's it. I've been doing it for nine years now. Bill, you're my hero. I love you. <laughs> well, that's the reason why I come, because all the Gothier brothers were going to be there, all 28 of them, and then they're associated, you know, the 180, you know, siblings, the little offspring. It's amazing. I mean, single-handedly populated all of southern Michigan, anything south of Flint, down down to the border. I think some of them even escaped to Indiana. Joey Gothier's in prison, and he's, that's the reason he's not here now. But uh, I think the 12-year-old's gonna drop the charges, and we're looking for him to get home any day now. How you take care of the leather, don't run into barbed wire fences, it tears the leather up. <laughs> You'll notice there's a little snag right here. here. You mean, you mean, <laughs> you mean like this? Yeah, just like that. Did the barbed wire fence do that? Uh, yeah, about 20 years ago. I wouldn't do anything like that. I understand. Well, we don't have any up here. But my southern draw, I don't have a southern draw. Taught guy how to talk like a I'm trying to teach him how, but he just doesn't learn very fast. <laughs> Old learners from up north just can't talk right. Nope. They just keep coming down here one after the other and for too long they're going to all get smart and come down here.